but don't be fooled. Here comes power. Zone, lead zone. Play action again. Pressure coming. Jones breaks free. Daniel Jones able to get back to the line of scrimmage. Screen. Third and nine. There's that screen. First touch for Barkley. Barkley, did he go down? He did. He tried to keep his balance, but Ryan Neal with a chop got the ankles out from under Barkley. Starts this possession once more for Seattle at the 31. And on first down, off the play fake, Smith directing traffic as he <laughs> finds Goodwin on the sidelines. And Goodwin making some plays in the open field, just tripped up across the 45 to the 48. Watching what the other guy's doing, taking a couple punches, landing a couple punches. Smith will step away from pressure and throws on third and long to DK Metcalf. Driven back, but he's got the first down. Fourth and two. And a little shovel ahead to Will Disley. First and goal, Seattle. Play action. Smith looking. Back of the end zone. DK Metcalf, touchdown, Seattle. On the all cross on the goal line, he's going to run the big in on the back end, saving a little space for Geno Smith to throw this up high. You see him at the top edge of the number, saving about a yard. He was going to cover that wide out that he was over by McKinney, and then he gave him, last second, he gave him those blitz eyes and took off. From the 25, Richie James trying to find some room. Ball is out, loose on the turf, diving on it at the 20. Looks like Seattle might have it field then maybe you start taking some shots trying to get in position for a field goal but they'll run it again potentially pressure oh. coming Jones is sacked Boye Mafe the rookie from Minnesota with his second sack of the year off the play fake Smith dumps it short to Homer trying to get to the sideline he's got good speed and Homer with a big play and a first down for Seattle Changed up his technique there. It's the ninth play of the second half for Seattle and a nicely designed play to get Lockett involved. Good spin on the sideline and a first down. That'll make Tyler Lockett feel a little better. Putting it only where Metcalf can get it. They're throwing it around the yard when you thought they'd be running. Double move. Lockett on the sideline. In for the touchdown. Redemption for Tyler Lockett. Seattle takes the lead. He's going to show like he's going to turn and just for a second and then he hits the gas again and gets thin at the top of that double move. See that how he kind of turned his shoulders a little bit. So Dory Jackson didn't have anything to contact, right? He had less surface area to contact. Give that pirouette and open up to the sideline just on the wrong page there. Richie James fumbled one earlier. Fields it at the 21. Looking to find some room. Oh, the ball's out again. He coughed it up a second time, and Seattle's got it. And laying it on the carpet, two massive, massive turnovers. And had Seattle out of sorts, and now they're back in the driver's seat. Ooh, Walker able to reverse his field. Walker inside the 10, oh. barreling over tacklers. Walker dances his way for the touchdown. He hit the thriller. Jones in trouble. Looked like the ball may have slipped loose. Nuosu. Opportunity to be in the lead still in the division. No doubt. Third down off the play fake. Better to take a sack than get a... How about a first down? How about Geno Smith runs to put it away? And Josh Jones to kind of take over that Earl Thomas role, which is nearly impossible because he's arguably a Hall of Famer. He's a heck of a player. And then Mike Jackson, he's more of your Brandon Browner. And Nuosu with his second sack of the day and the fourth Seattle sack. 30-17. Jones pressured. Sack! again fifth sack this one from Puna Ford and that will do it Seattle now five and three atop the NFC West as they hand the Giants their second loss of the year